Hi everyone, welcome to my latest video review. This is on the Starlight Studio Power Coins. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with who that person is, it's uh, he basically makes Power Ranger props that weren't released by Bandai America, like the Season 3 Power Coins, the White and Green Ranger Coins. And also he did some movie props from the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie. He also uh, does props that are like that were released like the power the original power coins like he makes them like a lot better quality he goes out of his way to do, do a really professional job from him I bought the green ranger and white ranger coins and the six ninjati coins however I'm gonna do them in two separate reviews I'm gonna wanna like tell you guys as much as I can without having to rush for it being ten minutes long so let's get started here. My favorites out of all of them are the green and white ranger coins because how detailed they are. They are. This is the white ranger coin. As you can tell, it's highly detailed as opposed to what I had before, which was. Let me see if I can find it here. As opposed to this right here. As you can see, the quality is a lot less and. Um, And, the and it's smaller, and the material that they used is not that great. And this coin, I could never really get it out to the power morph without like really struggling a lot. And eventually I gave up, because I would rather not break my power morpher. And these metal coins here, they go into the morpher with super ease. Like, you don't need to force anything. In fact, they, a lot of them actually go in the power morpher a lot better than the original power coins that were given by Bandai. And next is the Green Ranger coin. Again, another one of my favorites because of how detailed they look. I was just like jumping out of my seat seeing how perfect they look. As opposed to the old Green Ranger coin that I had here, which is right here. He made such a great job of the coins that um, to an unknown person, they would think that these coins right here are collector coins just by themselves and nothing else is needed as opposed to something that looks so cheap like this right here it's um, it's a well give off that it's part of like a toy or something because it doesn't give the off that professional look and then the last kind that I'm going to show you here is the falcon kind of uh, the white ranger he used it in season 3 so as you can see the quality again is a lot better. This is the old Falcon kind. So I'm going to show you the coins in the Power Morpher. And another good thing about these coins is the previous coins when you put it into the Morpher, there used to be like some kind of gap between the um, coin and the Morpher. And that's not there anymore, which is a huge plus. And also, the coin really complements the morpher because the two colors go really well and it makes the morpher look really good too. Here's the falcon. Let me just insert it here. And then last, our favorite, the Green Ranger. Green Ranger power. But yeah, it's, um, it's, they all look great with the Morpher. A lot, a lot better. And if you guys are in the midst of deciding who to go with because you guys want to get the extra power coins, I can't stress it enough, go with Starlight Studios because you will not be sorry because you're getting professional coins, A. B, you're getting coins that slide into the morpher with a lot ease because honestly a lot of these prop coins, they they uh, don't really go into the morpher. They do go into the morpher, but it takes a slight bit of work, so it's a slight bit tougher than the regular coins. 
and then see since it's metal and it's um and there's no like paint used in here you don't have to worry about any paint coming up so prop coins they use like gold spray paint or gold paint or whatever it is and through time like the coins that i had the gold will slowly rub off and you'll start and or it feels chip because what they do is a lot of them they make it off clay so the gold will like chip off and you'll start to see the white clay and you don't have to worry about any of these with these ones they might cost a bit more for you guys because of the professional work that's done but as time passes you will see how much more worth it is because sure if you'll get it for twenty ten dollars less if you go with other prop makers and stuff but you gotta consider that it's cheaper the price because the quality is cheap and then also they don't fit into the morpher that well but it's Basically, uh, the whole quality being cheap, so that's why you need to pay less. So, just fork out the extra, extra cash, and I, I'm just telling you, get these, and be done with it. Because these coins, I can already see it, they're lifetime uh, lasting coins. Because these cheap coins right here, I got them, I think, last mid last year, and already it's not really been much of a year yet. They're already starting to like chip and see the wolf coin here. I don't know if you can guys can uh, tell here. So you can see this already like chips on the wolf. The gold is coming up. With these coins you can see them lasting for years and years to come. So that's basically my review. And if you guys have any questions or concerns, please do not hesitate to ask me. And also a side note that I want to add is that I got around to getting a Power Rangers in Space Battle Lizer. At first it started off as just like a silly little bit that I did because those Battle Lizer things they go on for like they go for like a lot and <coughs> sorry I apologize for that and um I made a bit of $50 it was a loose Battle Lizer in great condition and I thought yeah right uh, my $50 bid will last probably a day or two and then some will overbid me, and surprisingly, no one didn't. And I end up, I and I ended up getting it, which I was shocked because these battleizer things, even loose, they go for like hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So look out uh, for that review. It didn't arrive yet. I'm get, I'm if I'm a lucky person, it will come hopefully Friday. But I highly doubt it. Knowing the how Canada Post works, I'll probably get it early next week or maybe late. But I know next week for sure. Um, sorry, so that's my review there. If you guys have any questions or concerns, uh, please don't hesitate to ask me. I will more than ha ha I will be more than happy to help you out. So my next review is on the Ninjetti coins, and there I'm going to show you other stuff too. Have a great day, and thanks again for watching my review.